Some teachers teach cursive, but it hasn't been a requirement since 2010. This bill changes that starting in the first grade. Cursive is an art form a lot of kids, including my six-year-old, know nothing about. What does that say? A. But that will soon change thanks to Governor Newsom, who just signed a bill that will require cursive instruction in first through sixth grades. Tell me why you think cursive is important. I want to see students all have the same access to our history. Really, it's our historical documents. Assemblywoman and former educator Sharon Quirk Silva wrote the bill after doing some family research. It came out of myself going on to 23andMe not too long ago and looking up some family records and realizing many of them were written in cursive. At Nichols Elementary in Oceanside, the brothers raced across the bridge. Cursive is already a part of the curriculum for these fifth graders. It's a choice teacher Christine Fuentes made after realizing cursive was becoming a lost art. Specifically the Constitution, one of the students said, hey, this is alien. And so I was like, oh, absolutely not. My main focus and goal was to create a connection for them to just learn certain letters. I have a classroom economy, and so we sign contracts, and so they're also practicing signing their name. Aside from being a practical tool, proponents say cursive is also great for learning. There's a lot of benefit to having cursive back in our instructional practices because it activates a portion of the brain that doesn't occur in print and or typing. It actually makes writing fluency easier for many children. Vicki Grablin is the executive director of curriculum instruction for Oceanside Unified. She says because cursive is standard at the district, she doesn't anticipate many challenges starting in January when the cursive requirement takes effect, adding if there is a learning curve, the district is ready for it. We have training opportunities for our teachers also with it built directly into the curricula. There is opportunity in their teachers' manuals to gather that information. It's just an ongoing overview of cursive and the goal being that by the time they leave sixth grade that they'll at least be able to read it and hopefully write it as well. Shanna Handy, CBS 8.